How one family argument almost stopped Man UTD from signing Alejandro Garnaco. One family argument almost prevented Alejandro Garnaco from joining Manchester United. Back in 2015, Garnaco joined Atletico Madrid's youth system from fellow Spanish side Getafe. Five years later, the young Argentine moved away from Spain to sign for United in a deal worth a reported fee of £420,000. After signing his first professional deal with United in July 2021, Garnaco made his first team debut in April 2022, coming on against Chelsea in a Premier League clash. Alejandro Garnaco makes Man United fan cry with gesture. Since then, the 19-year-old has made a total of 67 appearances for the Old Trafford club across all competitions, scoring 12 goals and assisting 7. However, United's head of academy Nick Cox has revealed how a family argument nearly prevented him from signing Garnaco. At the time, due to COVID, Cox couldn't invite Garnaco and his family to Manchester. As per The Sun, he said, I had to do that from my spare bedroom via video call, using a translator. My boys at the time would have been 14 and 10 and I remember vividly that they were arguing with each other while I was trying to sign Alejandro. Cox continued, I still tell my boys now, had that argument rumbled on much longer then we probably wouldn't have Alejandro Garnaco at Manchester United. Earlier in the season, Garnaco scored one of best goals in Premier League history when he netted a stunning overhead kick against Everton. Speaking about that goal, Cox said, For our really young players, to see a young boy score a goal like the one he did at Everton, that can only be an inspiration for them. There were bicycle kicks in our indoor area left, right and center the following week. When asked to describe what type of player Garnaco is, Cox said, A desire to try and do things that are a little bit unorthodox and try to entertain.